Hey friends, this week I'm sharing a recipe for vegetarian pate. Easy to make, this pate has so much flavor and texture, you'll be amazed it's meat-free. I hope you enjoy the recipe. For the ingredients have portobello mushrooms, vegetable oil, salt and pepper, chopped shallots, thyme, medium firm tofu, garbanzo beans, white beans, breadcrumbs, and soy sauce. Start by transferring the portobello mushrooms into a large colander. Gently rinse with cold water. Cut the mushrooms into chunks or simply quarter them. Transfer the mushrooms into a large baking pan. Spread everything out making an even layer. Drizzle with vegetable oil. Add salt, ground black pepper, and the chopped shallots. Place into the oven preheated at 400 degrees Fahrenheit and bake for 10 minutes. Once done, remove from the oven and let cool for 15 minutes. Remove the leaves from the fresh thyme. Cut the tofu into small cubes. Transfer the garbanzo beans and white beans into a small colander. For convenience, I'm using fully cooked canned beans. Wash off the canning liquid by rinsing with cold water. Toss in the colander to remove the excess water. Into the food processor, add the beans, tofu, roasted mushrooms, breadcrumbs, thyme leaves, soy sauce, ground black pepper, and salt. Process everything for 30 seconds, mix everything together, and then process again for another 30 seconds. For pate with good texture, repeat this interval one more time, so the total processing time is two minutes. For silkier, more mousse-like pâté, process at intervals for three minutes. Brush oil into four ramekins, coating the inside completely. Spoon the pâté into the ramekins. Try not to overfill the ramekins. The pâté needs a little room to expand during cooking. Use a spoon or spatula to smooth out the top. One method for cooking the vegetarian pâté is to bake it. Transfer into a baking pan. Cover each of the ramekins with foil. Bake at 400 degrees Fahrenheit for 20 minutes. The second method is to steam the pâté. Fill a steamer basin two-thirds full with water and then bring to a rapid boil. Steam over medium-high heat for 20 minutes. Once done, remove from the steamer and let cool for about 10 minutes. Cover the ramekins with plastic wrap and then place in the refrigerator. Chill for at least two hours. The cold air helps to set the pâté and improves the texture. For casual serving, garnish each portion with more fresh thyme and then serve from the ramekins. To dress it up a bit, unmold the vegetarian pâté, smooth it out using a butter knife, and garnish with more fresh thyme. Enjoy this delicious vegetarian pâté with crusty bread. Here are some other yummy options. Enjoy as a spread for crackers, a vegetarian dip with your favorite chips, or as a delicious vegetarian sandwich. Hi, I hope you've enjoyed this easy how-to video. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to post below. For full recipes, check out runawayrice.com. I work on new recipes each week, so please subscribe to my channel to stay tuned. This is Trang wishing you good eating and good health. Thanks for watching.